up everyone this is Damien the Disney Hacker here today we're at Disneyland if you're new to this channel welcome you guys are already part of the D3 Hacker family welcome back to the ride link this party started all right everyone we are here at it's a small world holiday here at Disneyland how amazing is that but today we're not going to talk about it's a small world holiday that's another separate video where you can watch the entire ride through of it's a small world holiday but today we are going to take a walk through Fantasyland and through Tomorrowland to grab our lunch. Today, folks, we're going to try one of the hot, delicious holiday treats here at the Disneyland Resort over at the Galactic Grill in Tomorrowland, the Cranberry Barbecue Chicken Sandwich. How amazing does that sound, folks? Wow. And we're going to top it off with a nice giant cup of Christmas punch. How cool is that, folks? As you can see, it's very busy here at the parks during the holiday season. Wow, look how crowded it is. But with that being said, folks, I already placed my mobile order. I strongly recommend you guys do that when you come to the parks, and specifically during the holiday season. Do the mobile order if you're doing like a quick service restaurant. But as you can see, my mobile order is ready. So I just accepted it, and I'm on my way to go pick up my mobile order at the Galactic Grill right now. You can see the Mad Hatter and Alice are there in front of us walking. See if we could catch up to them right now. <laughs> but the holidays are in full effect, folks. But this is going to be one of my first videos, my full videos for some of the delicious holiday treats here. As we navigate through this crowd, as you can see the majestic Matterhorn Bob says right there. So it should be like a couple of minute walk over to the Galactic Grill over in Tomorrowland. With that, being, with that being said, folks, I hope you guys are having a great time watching this amazing content. I love bringing this amazing content to you guys. Especially you guys who are not able to go to the park as often as I am. That's my goal here as a DP hacker, to bring you all the special treats and secrets of Disneyland as well as, you know, some of the hacks and the delicious specialties here. Right here as we walk along the Matterhorn Trail. See the Autopia right there in the distance. As we navigate through this crowd. It's quite busy today. It's not too busy today. This is one of the rare days I had to use the Genie Plus. So, my goal is to get a lot of content today and I'm like hey you know what let might as well get some ride in ride time in today but you can see this line right here for my, for the uh, Matterhorn it's not too too bad it's about a 45 minute wait right now it's right, right about lunch time so which is good as we walk up on the amazing lagoon here tomorrow land like a lagoon of the Finding Nemo submarine voyage right there as it goes around, about to go around right there. I love this view. This is a nice, amazing, picturesque view of the park right here. But with that being said, folks, we're not here for that. We're here to get our nice, delicious, try the new cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich. Wow, that just sounds delicious. So we're gonna rate that. I've had the Galactic Grill before. I've had the, of course, the amazing um, breakfast burrito there here so if you guys haven't seen the video I might post a link to that video where I did the view the review of the breakfast burrito at the Galactic Grill but with that being said folks here we are at the Galactic Grill here in Tomorrowland at Disneyland this long line right here we're not gonna stand right there folks that's the standby line we're gonna go right up to the counter and pick up our foods because we were smart and did mobile order. With that being said, folks, let's go get our food and find a place to sit down and try this delicious treat. All right, everyone, we found a nice quiet spot to sit over here in the Galactic Grill here at Disneyland in Tomorrowland. And we have our delicious cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich with our Christmas punch, which looks like it has some cranberries and orange slices in it, and a side of fries. We're about to try it right now. It looks so delicious. We're about to try it. We're about to try it right now. Here we go. Mm -hmm. 
Wow, this is delicious. Again, that's the cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich from the Lappy Grill. All right, everyone. Now that we've finished our delicious cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich, we're going to find a nice place to go discuss our review of the cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich and Christmas punch here from the Galactic Grill. Let's go. All right, everyone. I think we'll go head back over towards Fantasyland and find a nice quiet spot to talk and review our delicious lunch that we had today. I think we'll probably go head over towards the Lion King Theater over there in Fantasyland. I think it's a little bit less congested over there. So, but... Overall, it's a good day so far here, folks. It is Veterans Day here, and, and it's also the first day of the holiday season here at the Disneyland Resort, which goes all the way through, I believe, the first week of January. So, but yeah, it's going to be busy from here on out, folks, to just give you an idea. But yeah, after getting my order, I can just talk to you guys right now about that. The order is really good. I got through really quickly, I should say to get my lunch. So like I said earlier, I highly recommend you guys, you see this line right here, we walked past this earlier. I highly recommend you guys get, do the mobile ordering to save you guys a lot of time and headache here while you're at the parks. So anyway, I think we cut, we're gonna go this route. Let's cut through this route right here. We went this route earlier. So we're gonna cut through this back section. Cut through Fantasyland over here. A little less congested. I like the, these nice shortcuts through the park. As you can hear a herald in the background <laughs> right here on the, in the Matterhorn. Right there as we take a nice stroll. But yeah, folks. Pretty peaceful so far today, but lunch was delicious. Lunch was delicious, delicious. But anyway, as we continue our walk back through Fantasyland right here, go past Alice in Wonderland, which is always busy. Busy, busy, busy. You're gonna cut back over here, go through Alice by Alice in Wonderland, and head over back towards it's a small world, small world holiday over there to finish up our conversation. But a lot of good content coming for you guys in the near future, everyone. Thanks for your continued support. So I have about a nice series, this food series. I'm going to have about three or four treats, food treat series for you guys coming up. So I'm back in the parks this weekend I'm getting some more content I'm gonna try to get that oh ooh, there's a the brakes for the um, Matterhorn right there <laughs> but I'll try to get uh, try the try the Thanksgiving sandwich over at the Jolly Holiday restaurant so I was gonna try the Jolly Holiday today but the return time for mobile order was like too late it was like a four-hour window which lets you know it's extremely busy so the, typically the window is like an hour, hour and a half, but it was like four hours. And next is the line for the popcorn button buckets, folks. This is insane, just to get the popcorn buckets. Wow, these pails they have. Those are number one sellers. I saw a lady walking around with like 10 of those buckets. It's totally insane. I guess they're gonna probably sell them and make some extra cash. <laughs> But that being said, folks, we're almost at our destination back over here in Fantasyland where we all, when we first started our adventure today. And I think it'd be fitting that we end our adventure back over here in Fantasyland and have a nice little quiet review of our lunch. With that being said, folks, let's go find a spot to chat. All right, everyone, I've got a nice quiet spot right across here. From, it's a small world holiday here at Disneyland to have a little chat. Let's talk about our final review of our lunch we had over at the Galactic Grill. Now let's talk about the cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich first. Now that was pretty delicious. It was a little kind of a little kick to it, but I expected a little bit more. But it was it did its job. It satisfied my hunger. I'll say about a seven out of ten. 
it was pretty decent. Now, as for the Christmas sponge, you know, that was very unique. They had, it was, I think of it like a bor uh, boba drink, but with cranberries and pomegranate in it. That's what it was. I think that's geared for more the grown ups and not for the kitties. You know, so it's kind of like a bitter taste to it, but it was a good bitter taste like cranberry juice. So that's how I explained that Christmas punch. It was still delicious. I'll give it like a, the presentation was a 10 out of 10. I would say about an 8 out of 10 or 7 or 8 out of 10 because, you know, they had the frozen cranberries, which is understandable. But I'll give it like an 8 out of 10. But that being said, but overall, I think off to a good start for this full review of the holiday season. Well, folks, there you have it. This includes my review of the barbecue, of the cranberry barbecue chicken sandwich here at the Disneyland Resort and also the Christmas punch here at the Disneyland Resort at the Galactic Grill. I hope you enjoyed this episode like I did. Now, I would like to hear from you, D3 Hackers. If you'd like to continue to do more of these full reviews during the holiday season, feel free to leave a comment below. This should be fun. In the meantime, if you guys are still having your Disneyland withdrawals, Feel free to check out my channel. It has some fun, amazing Disneyland tips and fun and amazing Disneyland adventures to help get your Disney fix. Hey, folks, if you really kind of love the content of this channel and would like to contribute to this channel, feel free to contribute to my Buy Me A Coffee account at buymeacoffee.com forward slash D3+. Thanks again for watching. Hey, folks, if you like what you see, go ahead and click the like button below. And remember, feel free to share this video. More importantly, if you like me, go ahead and click the, ahead and click the subscribe button below and become of the of the D3 Hacker family. And remember to click the notification bell as soon as it drops the latest Disneyland news. And last but not least, folks, remember to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and also on Twitter. See you guys soon.